Yes, I'm here in front of the Rathaus Schöneberg. This is the place where uh, JFK or John F. Kennedy gave one of his famous speeches. I was out here this evening, and in the distance I heard uh, 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 some music, and I thought it was hallucinating, and I decided to come over here. And I saw these guys playing on the stage here, and I thought, hmm, what could this be all about? So I ran home and looked them up, and it's called uh, Glock and Clang or something like this. I'll put it on the screen down below so you get the proper name of it. It turns out that they're not a band. They're just a guy, a bunch of guys that got together and had a little bit of a jam session in front of the uh, 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 Rathaus Schöneberg here. For those of you who don't know what the Rathaus is, it's spelled R-A-T-H-A-U-S. That basically is, you know, where they collect your taxes and stuff like that, you know, hey. All right, so they had an interview with the guys, nice gentlemen, and I'll play this interview for you. Put some pictures of the bells, by the way. It turns out that part of the concert involved these three huge bells. That's right, right here. Did I hear the bell in the distance there? That's from the Rathaus Schoenberg, above there. So I hope you enjoyed this piece. See you next time. Over and out. It's, it's a project uh, just for, for this event. So this is planned for the for the anniversary, 100th uh, anniversary of, of this uh, town hall. And the idea was to, to have the, the Freedom Bell. It was the main uh, idea of this project. And to have, a, have nice music for a birthday party, you know, which reflects somehow the, the history of the, the town hall and what's what happened here, and so many special events uh, were happening here and all the people of Berlin still remember the, the visit of President Kennedy and there are some words written on them. So these are all artists w w which perform on their own you know the solo artists like Biashwa my friend, I'm, I'm having a solo project. I have another group, and Clark group, uh, playing uh, with the Star Sounds Orchestra. This is my main group. And um, then there is Rainer von Fielen, who has his solo group uh, and his, um, his group called Rainer von Fielen. And then Wolfram Der Spürer, he's a solo artist, electronic music. And he's involved in some uh, art objects and uh, clang installations, sound installations in the, in the artist's sector, you know, in museums or elsewhere. So these are all uh, solid state artists, let's say. <laughs> The bells there, are these, these bells for the, yeah, the, the concerts. This, this is uh, Udo, these bells uh, to tell the people that not throw away everything but recycle. You know, these are very old um, bells used in the war. And after the war, the people had some money again, and so they, they put uh, had other metal, the real metal for. for uh, Bells, which is called in German Bronze. I don't know which. which bronze. Is bronze. Same thing in English. Yes. Okay. Bronze and uh, these these are made of iron and uh, of steel. And so they threw away these bells. <laughs> it was just dumped it, and they took it off from the dump and put it on this place called Radayen, which is a very special place for. Uh, they are so nice objects all uh, which people normally throw away you know of old old time you know it's like recycling history yeah.
Messi, did you, how do you feel about your concert tonight, your performance? Oh, I feel, feel so great. The, the, the people were happy. And we were, you know, you have to say it's not a, not a normal concert. It's just, uh, most of it was just pure improvisation. We were practicing four days, but all what we did practice was uh, improvising. improvising. Because the, the, I'm really, really happy to, to perform with these musicians together. This is so special. It's uh, all about making music, you know, together. Yeah.